welcome back to mld world today friends in this video i will show you how to perform urea breath test already about machine i have informed first of all for urea breath test the patient must need minimum 4 hours or maximum 8 hours fasting after that we will give this 14 c capsule to the patient what is the purpose of this capsule when patient will take this 14 c label in capsule then the urease enzyme in the stomach will break down the urea into ammonia and 14c if 14c in easy words i will tell you 14c we will consider as h pylori so if in patient there is present h pylori in his stomach with this with breathing 14c will come out into the card now the patient is already for hours fasting so now i have given the capsule with the water and then we will wait for 15 minutes it's better to tell the patient to just sit for 15 minutes not to lay down and don't eat anything and especially take water also with little water and then if stopwatch or timer is available make it alarm of 15 minutes after the completion of 15 minutes we will start the test so first we, we what we need with for this test we need the card and the this holder this is coming with the kit only now i will open the card and i will attach the holder and then we will tell the patient to blow air into the card and do first in most the biggest precautions you have to tell the patient that take the breath from nose not from the mouth and then blow air through the mouth and second thing don't inhale back breathing first when you put the breathing into the card after that remove the card from the mouth take few second rest and then again breathe now i am explaining this thing to the patient and this blue color you can see the in the card when breathing will continuously we will do at least four minutes or five minutes this color will change into the white now you see he and now you will see again like that have to take deep breath and then put into the card and after that take out the card down now i make little video fast so that uh, no need to show 15 minutes continuously sorry 5 minute continuously but you have to tell the patient like that take the deep breath and then put into the card now you see still it's blue color so we will take the rest and then again we will tell the patient to put the air into the blow the air into the card this process have to take continuously at least three to five minutes it depends on the breathing how many breathings patient in put into the card and just in between few seconds patient can take rest also no need for continuously tell them to take breathe and exhale take breathe and exhale and the most important thing you notice that when he breathe the uh, exhale uh, sorry exhale air into the card after that keep the card down Bus? like that yeah now again we will see now you see the color is changing as before it was full dark and now it changes to white no need like necessary it should be full white but if patient exhale the air breathing at least five minutes it's also enough and then we will tell now i told that it's like you have to just breathe one two times more and it will be enough now he asked that still it's uh, need or no need so now he is breathing again after that we will insert and the name and id number into the machine about this machine already i have given the demo if you have not seen i will put the video link in the card from there you can see the machine how this machine works until now it's written no card now we will remove these stickers after breathing you can wait uh, if there are more samples already or there is already card in the machine it's no problem it's not urgent you can wait at least half hour and within half hour it's better to run the card in the machine now you see this result is negative hp negative and when result finish it's blinking red light so now it's negative 
so this will be it means this patient have no h pylori infection i will show you one positive result also now you see it was highly positive it's showing hp 4 plus 3250 must need to remove the stickers before inserting the card into the machine now i will share you some reference ranges if less than 99 it means no h pylori infection if between 99 to 149 it means that there is h pylori infection and if it is more than 149 to 499 it means 1 plus and if it is more than 499 and up to 1499 it is 3 plus and then 4 plus and 4 plus up to 2499 and then more than 2499 also it means highly positive and indicating h pylori infection so i hope you understand how to perform urea breath test in this video thank you so much